Welcome to Play In School TV, episode 12. I'm Rich Prado. In today's episode, we're going to talk about finding the right fit, playing offense versus defense in the recruiting process, and we're going to talk about the coolest ride to hit a college campus since Uber. A few weeks ago, I got to sit in on a recruiting talk by East Carolina recruiting coordinator Jeff Palumbo, hence why I'm sporting the purple and gold today. Coach Palumbo is widely considered one of the top assistant coaches in the country and one of the best recruiting coordinators in all of college baseball. Needless to say, he crushed the talk. He gave those parents about 90 minutes of just, just pure information. I spoke to a couple of the parents afterwards and, and assured them that no matter what the price of that camp was that their kid was attending, they got their money's worth with that one talk with Coach Palumbo. Now the word that he used more than any word in the entire talk was fit. God, he must have said the word fit a hundred times. He constantly stressed the importance that the kids that they recruit be the right fits for their program. Be East Carolina type of guys, he kept saying. He emphasized examples of actually passing on kids that they liked physically, kids with tools, kids that could play baseball, that they passed on because they didn't appear to be the right type of fit, did not appear to be East Carolina type of player. The big takeaway for me is that Coach Palumbo and the rest of the East Carolina staff knows exactly what their type of guy looks like. They know exactly what a guy that fits into their program looks like and that's exactly who they pursue. He then went on to emphasize to the parents that the same should be true for the kids. The kids need to be looking for colleges that are fits for them. He told examples of stories of kids picking schools for the wrong reasons. Picking schools that he knew was not necessarily the right fit for that kid. So let's discuss this for a second. I always talk about this as the difference between playing offense and playing defense in the college recruiting process. Offense meaning that a kid in their family has an idea and they know what their fit is and they're going after that. Defense meaning they don't really know what they're looking for and they are being reactive to coaches from all different types of schools, whether they're the right fit or not, uh, pursuing them. So let's talk about four important points. First, playing in front of a college coach does not help you research the college. So nobody's a bigger fan of the current format of travel ball than I am, but let's be 100% clear when we say that these showcases and tournaments are designed for the coaches to evaluate the players. Second, just because a coach likes you does not mean you are a fit for that school. Third, this is really important. This is gonna blow some minds. I want y'all to make sure you're listening here. If your only college baseball options do not fit within your parameters of what your best fit looks like, you don't have to play college baseball. Fourth, once you identify the parameters that make a good fit for you, then you need to target your communication towards schools like that. That's the difference between playing offense and playing defense in the college recruiting process. The reality is most kids simply don't know what the parameters are that they are looking for, and that's why kids are constantly playing defense in the college recruiting process. Ask a kid on Saturday what schools he's interested in and he has no idea. Ask a kid the following Saturday what schools he's interested in and suddenly that one school that likes him is now at the top of the list. That's how you can tell the difference between a kid playing offense and a kid playing defense. The reason we run our college bus tours is to put kids on as many different types of campuses as possible so they can begin to figure out the parameters that are important to them. I'll link to the details so that you can see the itineraries and all the information associated. All right, so coming full circle, I'm sporting East Carolina gear here today. I talked about Coach Palumbo, awesome recruiting coordinator down there. I wanna talk for a second about head coach Cliff Godwin. If you don't already follow him on Twitter, 
you, you're probably the only person in America who's not following him. He is absolutely crushing his social media game right now. He doesn't know I'm giving him a shot out, but you have to go look at the newest video he put up. He's doing something down in East Carolina that's amazing. It's the, it's the biggest thing since Uber. It's called Cliff's Cab. I'm gonna to link to the video so you can see it. Coach Gonwin is cruising around campus, drumming up excitement for the East Carolina baseball program. He's letting kids hop in the cab. He's giving them rods to, uh, to class and doing uh, like a trivia game along the way and all the while giving out East Carolina uh, gear. I'm keeping my fingers crossed that he's gonna have three or four of those golf carts ready when the North Carolina bus tour uh, hits East Carolina next summer. So coach, keep crushing your, your Twitter game. Uh, can't wait to be down there to see you guys play this spring. Guys, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat. That's right, I'm snapping now. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel, uh, all that. Hit me up, any questions, comments, down below and uh, see you soon at a baseball field uh, when the snow melts. Thanks.